Hi guys, welcome to our latest uh, review. Uh, this time we're looking at Piranha's latest river running creek boat, the Shiva. The main difference, you notice straight away with this boat, compared to Piranha's latest offerings of the Everest burn, uh, is the side rails or, or chines. The last batch of river runners from Piranha will have pretty hard rails running from bow to stern. Um, the Shiva has much softer chines rather than a rail. Right. So, the chine on the Shiva, you'll notice straight away the difference between uh, the Shiva compared to a boat more like the Mamba, uh, a diesel or, or the Burn, which have a much more continuous rail running up hard from the, the bow, full length of the boat, to the very, very stern. Shiva has a much softer side profile. Um, so the end's completely round, um, and then a soft, quite high um, chine in the midsection. What this means to the handling, if you think of a boat with a hard rail running from bow to, to stern, you need you don't need too much angle um, on that boat. There's a you know, you've always got a good a good amount of rail in the water, um, and much like a snowboarder or a skier, that rail as you as you lift or, or drop an edge has a massive effect how that boat then turns through the water, um, you know, on relatively small angles of you know, input from the paddle. Um, on the Shiva. Um, with the boat being much rounder in the bow, in the stern, the boat still moves you know, nicely. It's, a very, it's still a very nice maneuverable boat, but you will have to put the boat on a much harder edge to get the, a similar effect from the boat. The Shiva also has a much more progressive rocker brake throughout the whole length of the boat. This means running bigger drops, pushing, you know, pushing through big holes, big waves, the nose is much easier to keep up um, and keeps, you know, keeps the boat a lot drier. We think for beginner whitewater paddlers, the Shiva isn't necessarily probably going to be the easiest boat for you to learn in. But if you're a more advanced paddler looking to push your limits on bigger, steeper, more technical whitewater, this boat should suit you fine. I have to say we need to take it on a, bit, a few more rivers. We've only taken up the Trerin so far. Uh, look forward to um, yeah, getting some rain and hitting some steeper creeks, Wales, Scotland, and really giving it a good thrashing and seeing what it's like. See you later. Bye.